you to talk to me about May. Are you very much in love with her? As much as a man can be. Do you think there's a limit? In a time of tradition, in a place of privilege, Newland Archer lived his life by the rules of his society. I want everybody to know. What? That we're engaged. <laughs> Until he met a woman who lived by her own rules. I think they're all a little angry with me for setting up for myself. I hear she means to get a divorce. She made an awful marriage, but that doesn't make her an outcast. I came to see what you were running away from. All I really want is to feel cared for and safe. Is there someone else? We should remember marriage is marriage and Ellen is still a wife. When can I see you? I can't be your wife, Newland. Is it your idea I should live with you as your mistress? You gave me my first glimpse of a real life. And then you asked me to carry on with a false one. No one can endure that. I'm enduring it. Everybody knows. <sighs> Have you considered the consequences? What the hell does that mean, sir? From the Pulitzer Prize winning novel. Shall I come to you? Come to me. Columbia Pictures is proud to present Daniel Day Lewis, Michelle Pfeiffer, Winona Ryder. They never knew what it meant to be tempted, but you did. <laughs> the Age of Innocence, the Martin Scorsese picture. Will you come with me to Howard's End? in your mother's handwriting. I would like Miss Schlegel, Margaret, to have Howard's End. I heard two ladies talking of love. <laughs> no, no, we were continuing a serious discussion. I could scratch that woman's eyes out. Why, if it isn't Henry, aren't you going to say hello? No, Mrs. Bath. No, I don't. It's just you and me. Don't take up a sentimental attitude over the poor. See that she doesn't, Margaret. The poor are poor. One is sorry for them, but there it is. Everything's got spoiled for you, hasn't it? I forgave you. My sister has a lover. You drive her from the house. Why can you not be honest for once in your life and say to yourself, what Helen has done, I have done? I thought we were going to see the Arno. Lucy! 
I have met the type before. They seldom keep their exploits to themselves. Exploits? <laughs> this way, Mrs. Honeychurch. Follow me. Do you know anything about Miss Lavish's novel? There's a scene in it. The hero and heroine make love. Do you know about it? They're on a hillside and Florence is in the distance. Oh, dearest girl, she hasn't put that in her love. My attitude, quite an indefensible one, is that so long as I'm no trouble to anyone, I have the right to do as I like. It is, I dare say, an example of my decadence. I don't mean you're going to marry that man. He's the sort who can't know anyone intimately, least of all a woman. You love the boy body and soul as he loves you. of a new life. We can't leave the piano. But there are two fewers here to carry it now. She came to a husband she had never met. And it was time I'm sure she would become affectionate. And discovered a passion that would change her world forever. Harvey Keitel, Sam Neill, The Piano. The critics say, so moving and original, it is a triumph. One of the most enchanting love stories ever filmed. Erotic. Mysterious. Exquisite. Jane Campion is one of the most splendid filmmakers around. Passion has no limits. The Piano, from acclaimed director Jane Campion. One motion picture will bring you all the surprises that life and love can offer. You are the loveliest girls I ever set eyes on. Can you not get them married, Mrs. Dashwood? Mary Ann and Eleanor, as different as two sisters can be. Do you love him? I do not attempt to deny that I think very highly of him, that I greatly esteem him. Esteem him? Like him? Eleanor is not like you or me, dear. She does not like to be swayed by her emotions. Columbia Pictures invites you. The more I know of the world, the more I am convinced that I shall never see a man whom I can truly love. To fall deeply. Marianne, you must change. You will catch a cold. What care I for colds when there is such a man? You will care very much when your nose swells up. You are right. Help me, Eleanor. To feel intensely. There's something of great importance that I need to tell you about. Why did you not urge him to stay? He must have had his reasons for going. I do not understand her, Mama. Why does she never mention Edward? Eleanor. Where is your heart? <laughs> to surrender completely. Your sister seems very happy. Do you think he'll kneel down when he asks her? Shh. They always kneel down. To risk everything. We know so little of him. What is it you suspect him of? Willoughby! <laughs> From Jane Austen's timeless classic. Comes a motion picture beyond all expectations. Academy Award winner Emma Thompson, Alan Rickman, Kate Winslet, 
and Hugh Grant. Sense and Sensibility.